take something that's really valuable and make it worth less. Or take something that's valuable and make it worth more. Like, um, did I ever tell you about the painting machine? It's a machine that you take paintings and it goes through the machine and puts paint all over it. But we take existing paintings Somebody already painted the painting. Send it through the machine. We know about that. Okay. Most of the paintings that go through the machine were just found or no one wanted them, right? But then an artist that I know said, well, here, take this painting, put it through there. The painting is worth probably $2,000, at least, maybe more. Um, then it goes to the painting machine. Now, how much is it worth now? The answer is we don't know. It could be a lot less, a lot less. Or, you know, like if Picasso had said to someone else, here, do something to this. Would that be worth anything? It might be worth more than most Picassos if he authorized it. That fascinates me. I've lived here most of my life. Well, I was born in Florida and then Nebraska, which is a nearby, same geography we talked about, and then Kansas City, when I was a child, and then here, and I lived at University of California, Berkeley, I was there, and Albuquerque, New Mexico, I lived there for a while. Most of the time I've been here. At one time, I had grown-up jobs. I wore a tie and a suit. But that wasn't very much fun. And so, a long time ago, I started, a, I had my, a construction company. And that's how I made money. Making, building, fixing, making things. I don't work that much anymore, but I'm pretty busy. <laughs> I have a lot of art projects, a lot, a lot of projects, and I still do quite a bit of consulting with people about construction projects. They know that but they need uh, consulting. You may use this phrase. It's called <laughs> cheap. Motherfucker. I am a cheap motherfucker. What that means is rich people that want to save money come and talk to me about how to do the project. But I will help them make it $10,000 instead of $20,000. Okay. That's pretty valuable, I have to say. It's one that comes natural to me. I came from a very cheap family. There's a, um, a friend of mine has a collection of found film. He finds rolls of film. This takes years. He finds the camera somewhere. He gets the film developed. And so he has this book. It's all found pictures. He's a photographer himself, but he just finds these pictures and then has them developed and so on. And now, um, more recently, he found a digital card and he you know, saw the pictures from it. He found, so it's a more modern version of found pictures. And he, um, 
he bought a telephone for like one dollar, but it had pictures on it. Hey. He's going to be able to continue his art, even though the technology is changing. It's what we call hustle. There's somebody who plays the guitar. And so eventually it's a uh, pussy girl. Does someone play the guitar better than she does? Oh, shit. But are they pussy girls? No. They, the pussy girl knows she can sell it, hustle, and then sometimes you lie about it. Okay, so I have a piece of art that is very controversial uh, that maybe I could be hurt by People, they might try to hurt me if they thought I made it. But I say oh, I that I found it. I found this. It's very disturbing. It's bad. It's wrong. And so Because I'm not courageous enough to say, fuck you, I made this. The same with um, the uh, baby heads. If the baby head says it, you say, it's a baby head. No, no, you say, no, 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 no. The baby can say things that I could say them, but in some ways it's more, more interesting when the baby head says something. And the other thing that the baby head can do is say something that's really childish and stupid and if I say it they'll say well you're a grown up you're a grown up artist and you said that that's really stupid but if the baby head says it see eh. or if you say you found it well this is just a scrap of paper I, I found this on the ground in Moscow it was just laying there did you write that no There's a limit to what the baby head can do. There's a limit to any of these things. People say that there isn't, but there, that's not true. There's a huge limit, lots of limits. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Can I take your picture? No. No? No, never. Please. Ah, ha, ha. All right.